More of an early spring-like pattern here is gripping onto our early weekend forecast. We're even starting off our Friday with some of those teens for low temperatures from Yellowstone, Cody into Sheridan, 25 into Whirland, 26 into Casper. And we're still noting that for the most part, we're generally quiet, but there is still a wave of energy that is going to keep some spotty mix in our forecast for our Friday before the rest of our weekend is generally expected to be on the drier side. And we're going to see warming temperatures through Sunday as we'll be back up into the 60s, but there is a quick little system that will pass on by Sunday into Monday that could allow for some windier conditions and a few chances for some showers. Little pullback in the temperatures, not as cold as our current temperatures before we have a bigger jump in our highs that could get us back to the 70s into next week. Now here's we though linger with this system. Note that for the most part, we're going to see a day full of some of that mixed sunshine similar to our Thursday with temperatures again holding within those 30s might even stray away from 40s for high temperatures. We also have that northerly flow, not too strong, but we're noting that a lingering piece of energy is departing. So that's allowing for little spots of some of these, especially mountain snow showers. Some little spots could have some wintry mix make its way down to the surface. Our biggest uh, area where it's gonna, there will be some impacts is going to be down towards I-80 from Laramie, Cheyenne into Sydney there. And then we'll see that system really pulls its way out. Some mountain light snow showers possible, but for the most part, we're seeing that a lot of the emphasis will stay to the south as we roll into Saturday's outlook. So when it comes down to accumulation, as mentioned, we might see some mountain snowfall continue to accumulate, but nothing for those lower elevation points outside of that region there from Laramie Cheyenne into Sydney on Nebraska, where that wave of energy will keep a few spots there possible into Saturday morning. So as we look across the region, note that we will want to keep those winter layers on hand. 33 into Cody for a high temperature, only 45 into Riverton, 37 into Gillette, 39 into Casper. So keeping temperatures nearly 20 degrees below normal. The good news is that this is the cold point of the weekend, and then we will start to warm. Our Saturday does try to bring those temperatures up at least a few degrees. We see 40s looking to be more likely area-wide from Gillette, Casper, even Medicine Bow. Rollins Muddy Gap have a chance to be back up into those low 50s, as well as Riverton at 54 degrees. So sunshine this time of the year does help to make a quick rebound in that temperature trend. Now, as mentioned on Sunday, we will have our temperatures at the warmest point for the weekend, thanks to the help of some winds that will be up to about 30 miles per hour. But there is a quick passing system that does bring us back under those northerly winds on Monday. So we will go from near seasonal temperatures or above their Sunday to then see that we are back into those 50s with some of those early rain showers on Monday. Quick moving systems, not too big of impacts there, but we will note we have another trend of some warming into the rest of the work week.